big city has dangers that lurk and there are a few of course golden rules for safety um, see my concern as a parent basically are is twofold one is her physical safety in a place and the second is the kind of friends that you make because that determines a lot uh, for your life the right company the wrong company bad company good company because that shapes the quality of your experience in a city as a parent i can only be concerned i can only guide her i can only uh, hope for the best for her um as far as physical safety are there you know few golden rules are there you do know which is carry a pepper spray don't go down dark alleyways um you know always go to well lit streets and stay with people that you completely trust and never ever 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 leave your drink unattended um because people can spike it um you know um you know make sure you get straight from the bartender and if you're on a table even if you know the person finish your drink and then go to the bathroom and then come back and order a new drink but never leave your drink unattended okay that's very important uh as far as your studies go get the grades put in a lot of money to make this happen for you so you know make it make it worth the while um and do call me from time to time and tell me you miss me i mean it's okay to miss your parents and it's okay not to be the school teenager that just needs space and doesn't care about the parent you know no, it's kind of really nice to know you can now be 20 right you like 20 Waiting, bit bated breath for twenty, but you're 20 going at. Twenty is gonna be such a disappointment but, to you. But you're going. So much, but you're going at eighteen. Hang on, the fact is you're going at eighteen. So even all through eighteen and all through nineteen, I would really like to know that I'm loved and missed dearly. And please, can you at least give that to me while you're there? I'm a. I'll be heartbroken. You're going there. I'll be heartbroken not even telling me you love me and miss me like crazy out there. And you're not, you know, be paid these two three tears for me. Calm down. Everything is about you. I'm in New York. I just don't know it's all about her. Why I'm everything? left behind because I'm no, left behind. I'm going alone. You have everything you have here. I'm going alone. Not everything is about you. It's not about you. So then I can come and visit you often. No. Why? It's no. all about no. You're I, you, all alone. You have to give me my space, Mama. <laughs> I'm going all the way to New York because I want my space. You're going to New York for space. You're going for the best film school in the world. Both. I want to. I could have gone to very good film schools in India if I wanted to. I'm going abroad because I want my space. I want to be away. Very expensive. Want my space? <laughs> Just going to very expensive. I don't even space. want to come back in the <laughs> Christmas break. You're yeah. forcing me to come back down. I said I don't want to come back for Christmas. I'll be gone three months and I'll be back. Yeah, but three. Hello, three months. Don't say three months like this. It's three whole months. It's four like years. ninety days. Four years. Yeah. 90 days Ali of not being with me. I mean I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I I I need you. You know full stop. Yes, I need you. Let me say it. I need you. You may not need me. I need you. I need my babies around me. I need to feel and hug and kiss and just know you all are there and you know. Do you just hug the pillow in the absence of you? Yes. <laughs> you or just something. <laughs> <laughs> But I do that sometimes, you know. It's like it's like when they were when they were younger. Um, I would lie down, and Alia would come on one shoulder, and Omar would come on the other shoulder, and I put my arms around them, and one breath here, one breath on my neck here, and I used to you know hug them tight, and we used to go to sleep. And it was the most amazing parent moment ever. I mean, just to know that those two little bodies, the little breath, the trust, the love, the it's just the most beautiful parent moment ever. And there are times when I miss those moments, and there are times I put two pillows next to me and pretend that that's them. Um, that is so weird. That no, is it's so not. weird. That's so depressing. Firstly, no, it's depressing. just so, so. I just miss you all so much. You know, I mean, recently I had a, an experience that was kind of life-threatening, and I almost died on an operating table recently. And when I came back uh, from the hospital, um, and I had um, Alia and Omar there, of course, seriously concerned. And uh, Alia was like pressing my feet, and Omar was also pressing my feet, and both of them were just there, refusing to leave my side. uh it was really late their exams the next day but they were just there for me with me massaging me taking care of me hugging me kissing me and you know at moments like that you realize that on a show like f and b she can turn around and she can be like mama don't touch me mama give me space mama this but that so much of love and there's so much of bonding and there is so much of care and compassion that these kids feel for me so i don't feel bad that you turn around and tell me things like mama you know give me space and you're so suffocating because i know when push comes to shove you guys love me to death 